You think being alive means being you, breathing, thinking, feeling. But neuroscience reveals something terrifying. You can be alive without being yourself. There are documented cases where the body functions perfectly. The heart beats, the brain processes information. Yet the person is gone, not dead, erased. This happens when specific brain networks shut down. Not memory, not intelligence, but the sense of self. In conditions like depersonalization, patients describe the same thing. I'm still here, but I'm not me. The brain stops generating identity. Your name still exists. Your memories still load. Your body still moves. But the feeling of being someone disappears. Neuroscience shows that the self is not a single place in the brain. It's a fragile pattern built from synchronized activity between multiple regions. When that synchronization breaks, the self dissolves. You don't fade slowly. You don't feel pain. You simply vanish. The world looks real. Sounds are clear, but nothing feels owned. Thoughts happen, but no one claims them. Actions occur, but no one feels responsible. The brain continues running. The body continues living, but the narrator is gone. And here's the most disturbing truth. This state can last minutes, days, or years. Some people recover, some never do. The brain can erase you without shutting itself down, without alarms, without damage, just by altering how it binds experience together. You are not guaranteed to exist just because you are alive. You are a temporary configuration, a pattern that can fail while the system keeps running. Death shuts the body down. This is worse, the body lives, the brain works, but you are gone. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit the bell for more amazing science videos.